While some robots can look quite complex, they're actually very simple to assemble. In these short videos we're going to show you how to create various different features to assemble the tumbler. Fitting a collar onto one of these shafts is very simple. Take the collar, slide it onto the shaft and using the small allen key, place the allen key inside the grub screw and twist until it locks in place. You can see now that the, the collar is secured onto the shaft which can allow you to then fit on something like a wheel and that wheel will be fitted into position. To add fittings onto the uh, metal chassis, take fittings like the bearing, place them into position, use a screw and place the screw through one of the holes. Turn over the chassis and from behind apply one of these nuts and twist on by hand. To secure this part in place, you can use one of the larger Allen keys, place your finger behind on the nut and twist and lock. Or for more strength, place one of the, the small spanners into position and then again use the Allen key to twist and lock in place. Pop rivets are very easy to secure to the frame. Take one of the bearings, locate it to the metal, into the holes, and placing the, the first part of the rivet into the holes, we can then take the smaller, narrower part, thread it through, and pop these into place with a click. This has now secured the bearing onto the surface. It's not the strongest position but we can replace each of these pot rivets with screws and nuts. To join metal work together it's very simple. Simply locate two or more holes place a screw through the hole and locate the nut to the opposite side Simply thread those together by hand and then again we can secure with our finger behind and twist with an allen key to lock and for a more secure fitting we can take the small spanner, we can hold the nut in place and apply additional force to twist that screw into place. This metal is now secure in one position, a second position will then lock that frame at 90 degrees.